Hey iPhone people, I said I'd do another video on this, so real, real quick one. How to change Chrome as your default web browser in iOS 14. There's a couple ways to do it. Uh, this is a great feature as far as I'm concerned because iPhone for years made you use Safari. And then, you know, you'd open something up and then it, Google Chrome lets you sync all your your openings and everything. So if I open something on my phone, I go back to my computer, it wouldn't store it in my history and it wouldn't have all my passwords and my information that fills in automatic fill and all that. Well, with Chrome, because it syncs anytime you open an app, if you log in, all your bookmarks are there, all your history is there. Anything you do goes into your history. So when I open something up on my phone, I can go back to my computer later, check my history, and it'll be there. So uh, to me, this was a great feature. Pretty easy. You go to uh, Settings, and then you go to Chrome, and then it says Default Browser. It says Safari, and then you open that up, and you go to Chrome. The other way to do it is if you open up Settings, and then you go to Safari and open it up. It gives you an option now to select either Chrome or Safari. Now, again, you have to download Chrome on there and have Chrome downloaded on your iPhone in order for it to give you the option. So you have to download Chrome, maybe open it up and log in, and then it will give you the choice of choosing your default. Uh, Safari wasn't a bad browser, but again, it wasn't as convenient as Chrome because it didn't store everything. So that's how you change your app now. Great if you did your uh, iOS 14 update. You can now do this and uh, figure it out, pass that on. Have a good one. Will Annette there?